What is up, fam? Welcome back to Leslie Jones Tarot. Let's dive in and see what messages come out for you all. So let's see. <laughs> hey, boo. All right, what's going on? What's the energy? The energy. Let's just check in and see what the energy is at this time. What's going on? What's going on? What's the energy? Eight of Wands and Five of Swords. Well, what the what? Nine of Swords at the bottom of the deck. Okay, well, the energy is there could be like some fast communication that's coming in, okay? I'm getting like arguing, fighting, conflict. Ugh. Something's happening like really, really fast with the Ed Wands. Like something's about to be like sped up or like about to move fast, but with the five of swords, um, it's, it's like competitive energy. I'm getting like, com like somebody in competition, somebody wanting to win at all costs, somebody, you know, like either going in or coming in with some sort of sneaky energy with that knight of swords, three of pentacles, somebody could be collaborating, working with another people, but uh, person or people. But the Tempest card is here. The Seven of Swords is here too, though. My goodness. Somebody could, okay. The Empress. Somebody could be strategizing. Okay, somebody could be being strategic here. All right. But somebody could also be lying, cheating, stealing. And there's about to be balance restored as somebody collaborates with other people. Somebody's like a fast thinker. What is it? Oh, she is falling out. Hold on, y'all. Okay. Sorry about that, y'all. Okay, there we go. I think I'm gonna invest in a tripod, honey, and just, I got one, but I, it didn't hold the phone right. Okay, but anyway. So yeah, Edwin's Five of Swords Energy, fast communication. Let's see what this is, because I wonder, especially with this Knight of Swords underneath here. What does this have to do with spirit? Clarify the Eight of Wands. What's the Eight of Wands movement? There could be some traveling as well. But I would be careful. Like this is like this would be like traveling somewhere, right? Like it's giving like road rage, eight of wands, five of swords energy. So I'd be careful, you know. What's the eight of wands about? What's the eight of wands about? Spirit. What's that eight of wands about? Challenges. Make a decision, work on inner healing. Yeah. Guardian, a lost loved one watches over you. You're protected. Whatever this is, you are protected as things are manifesting quickly for you this is like choosing to heal choosing to move forward um and you're being protected from it some of y'all are being protected from like a gold digging energy this is somebody want to win at all costs like this would be like like say you're trying to okay it's giving me <laughs> that's a weird that's a random one it's giving me uh there's this christmas movie <laughs> i'm seeing it. it's funny there's this christmas movie and the woman, they're fighting over a ham in the store. <laughs> like a canned ham. Oh my gosh, what is the name of that movie? But that's what I'm seeing. I'm seeing that scene. And they're like literally fighting over and they're like pushing each other in the buggy. Like trying to knock each other. It's giving that. Like trying to win at all costs. <laughs> and then she gets to the track and she's like, so how much don't your kids need to go to, don't you need tuition or something like that? I don't know, for a canned ham child. I don't know. <laughs> I cannot think of what it what, what the name of that movie was. It's funny. Me and my mom laugh about it every year. It's our it's our biggest Christmas joke. Hey mom, you want a canned ham for Christmas? <laughs> Spy and someone else popped out too. So there could be other people involved here, but give me more on this eight of wands. Give me more on this eight of wands, please, spirit. So quick, swift change. Something could be changing. When it comes to you healing too, like some sort of swift change could be happening for you to move forward so you can heal as well. So what's that about with the Eight of Wands? Ooh. Incarcerated, locked up, about to be always in and out. Okay. And cyberbully. I'm telling you, I'm getting that energy of like road rage. Like somebody having road rage or like somebody trying to beat somebody to something or... Somebody could also be getting like locked up or going to jail. So please be careful with that eight of wands and five of swords there. Please be careful. Um, and then I'm seeing the cyber bully energy it says you are being bullied online or they are, has suffered from it. Some of y'all could have, 
I don't know if somebody's like trying to bully you or like trying to like it's giving me a real nasty energy. Some of y'all could be married to this person that says marrying for money. Uh or like y'all work with this person in some sort of way. Like some of y'all some of y'all y'all own partners like trying to take you out or like trying to bully you or trying to win at all costs like this. If y'all going through a divorce or something. Uh, crying over you, sad, hurt, upset, etc. Always partying. But this is somebody that chooses like the party lifestyle over over you, or they chose the party lifestyle over you, or something like that. But they like it's giving me like drinking, partying to like cover their pain type of energy. Oh, child, what's the yeah. Into you, good chemistry, great vibes, and positive is here. And then we also have lonely. And then queen rising, stepping into power place, coming up in spotlight. So it's like you, yeah, screenshots, getting proof, getting evidence, proof, and facts. Jackpot energy is here. So it's like you got this good energy. You doing you. You vibing high. Or this is what spirit is telling you to do. Keep vibing high. Keep staying in this positive energy. But somebody feels lonely. Like, like they feel left out from you or... As things are starting to take off for you, and it's kind of like you're you're healing, you're working on healing, you're choosing to heal, you're choosing to move forward and heal, and then by you doing this, it's making somebody else feel left out because they can't run in and out of your life anymore. Maybe they bullied you because you chose to heal instead, and or, or this is what they're doing. Like this is like this is a really ugly energy, but it's because they feel left out from whatever you're doing, the 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 movement forward, like the rapid. The rapid change that you're having in your life, I don't know if something's like taken off for you or something, especially with that jackpot. It's like somebody sees you winning some sort of abundance or getting some sort of unexpected money or something like that. And it's like somebody's like, well, I'm going to bully them to make them feel less than like they don't deserve it or something. Yeah, bankrupt. I don't, um, let me see. Mm, yeah, let's, let's pull these cards here and see. It's like, let me let me bully this person so that they can not step into their power. It's kind of like, you could be like a real good energy, but maybe you're kind of like, you know, black sheep type of person. And they're like, let me bully them to make them feel like they're not the cool kid, but really you the cool kid because you authentically you and you stand out. like. And so maybe they bullied you and now they can't really rock with you. You know what I'm saying? It's like bullying the, the the nerd and then the nerd ends up growing up and being like somebody super famous and then you can't rock with the nerd because you bullied them. I don't know. It's, it's given like that. Like somebody didn't expect for your growth or your healing to happen as quick as it did or I don't know. Let's see. Clarify the speed. Tarot reader or tarot reading. Some of y'all could be a tarot reader. Okay. You can do what I do. Or you're getting some sort of tarot reading and maybe you're tapping into this and you're finding this out. Some of y'all could be like light workers. I need to put that in a card too. Yeah, Cinderella syndrome, destiny swap. Somebody could, it's like, this is like giving me, hey Arnold, you know, Helga Pataki and hey Arnold. Like she actually wanted to like chill with Arnold. She wanted to be with Arnold because she was in love with him. But like she couldn't let nobody else know like, oh my gosh, I'm in love with him. Instead it's like, oh my God, I can't stand you football head. Like, you know. But really, she was deeply in love with him. Or this could be somebody like, say somebody bullied you being a tarot reader. And they're like, ha, 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 ha. This person reads tarot. They read cards. They look stupid. But really, in reality, they wish that they could do what you do. You know what I'm saying? It's that. Like, I don't know. They, <laughs> what about the Eight of Wands with the Challenges card? Maybe they bullied you, made fun of you or something. Hey, Naz, water sign. Some of y'all dealing with another water sign, Cancer Scorpio Pisces, hair salon or barber shop. They could gossip about you or somebody that could be significant. You could be a hairstylist or a barber. Factory worker or line assembly. Okay. Who's your daddy shorts? Cigar cigarette or cigar could be significant. This person could smoke. You could smoke. We have brown or gray eyes. GPS tracking or watching and spying. This person could be watching you, spying on you, tracking you down. A car or SUV could be significant. Head wraps and crown protection. Some of y'all need to protect your, your crown here. Chest tattoos could be significant. A balloon. Something about a balloon or balloons. 
short or long curly hair could be significant. So it's like you stepping in your power and this person like, <laughs> like they bullied you. <laughs> look at them. They look crazy. They look stupid. And then, but you're healing and like you, this good vibe energy, you know what I'm saying? It's like somebody mad because they can't be on your journey with you or something. I don't know. <laughs> That's crazy. Or this is what Spirit's telling you to do. Keep going. No matter what, who bullies you or who tries to like pick at you or like make fun of you or whatever, you keep going. Don't, you know, you stepping in your power. You know what I'm saying? You getting people recognizing you for your healing. You're not who you used to be. Okay, keep moving forward. What's that? Oh my gosh, that saying. Keep moving forward. Uh, it's on uh, Meet the Robinsons. It's a cartoon at the end. It's like, no matter what, keep moving forward. Whatever you do, okay? Y'all ignore my ashy elbows, okay? Five of Swords. What's that Five of Swords? So yeah, this the Five of Swords is bullies. So some of y'all, y'all got bullies coming at you or something like that. What's Five of Swords energy? Or some, this is about to be seen. Pets. Getting a new pet, giving a current pet more love. So what's the bottom? Yes, luck is on your side. So yeah, you could have been loyal to this person or y'all got something to do. Like maybe y'all had pets together with this person or... You show loyalty to this person, or you were still loyal to this person, even though they bullied you or something like that. Intimacy, sexual chemistry. This is a. This is also the type of person that like to have options. Because I got intimacy here with that uh, pets card. So this person. Ooh. Okay. I'm gonna tell y'all what I just heard. I just heard I'm a dog. 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 So this person could be a dog. Like they dog people out. Child, this person could be, you know, roguish. <laughs> like, they could dog people out, treat people like pets. Like, I'm going to play with you and give you a little attention, then I'm going to set you off. Okay, as long as you stay loyal to me. You know what I'm saying? Don't pull that off here, baby. As long as you stay loyal to me, we good. And then I'm going to give you a little attention, then I'm going to play with somebody else. Okay, that's what it's like. Y'all could be, I mean, y'all could be pregnancy. Someone is expecting, somebody could have got pregnant. <sighs> Manifest and narcissist that. Somebody could have, you know, planted seeds with somebody, manifested something, and then somebody, someone is too full of themselves, and then somebody became narcissistic because we got narcissists. Manifest and narcissist. Somebody, somebody could have, like, wanted you to be loyal to them after they not bullied you, though. Like, what? Oh my God. Somebody could have manifested this person to be this energy to you. I don't know. What is this? Give me one more on the Five of Swords with the Pets card. Five of Swords with the Pets. It's not the right time. Now, you had luck on your side at the bottom of the deck when I pulled. Now, this energy is coming out. It's not the right time. So, somebody trying to bully you. Intuition. The red flags you ignore now will come back to bite later. Divorce. Experience a breakup. Some of y'all have already broken up with this person or you're divorcing this person or you're ending a contract of some sort with this person. No longer working with them. And so, and it could be because it, maybe you're in a workplace and like these people are bullies and you're just like, oh my God, like I got to leave this job. I can't keep being here. Like this is ridiculous. Some of y'all, this could be people like they there's a whole clique or a whole clan. You know what I'm saying? Like they clanning up together. This could have been somebody that was in an abusive that you were in an abusive relationship with too. Like what's what's five swords? Uh, yeah, haunted memories, flashbacks, trauma, side effects. Somebody could have bullied you and was narcissistic, very self-absorbed towards you here bankrupt and now they're being left out so i mean what the, what are they tripping for so you chose to heal and move forward and move on and this person chose to bully you in the past even though you were showing up loyal to them what are you doing mama what's going on cloud oh they did it for cloud they did this for cloud it says says anything does anything make ish up and dramatic okay so this person, they were doing things for clout. Yeah, they're smiling in your face and acting fake behind your back, okay? Mm-hmm. Acting like they was loyal to you, acting like they was cool with you, but no. This would even be with the it's not the right time. This would be the type of person that they pick and choose when they want to be loyal to you. You know what I'm saying? Like, this would be the type of person... Uh, they'll be loyal to you on social media like oh no we best friends we cool for the clout right do it because of attention but then when when all h-e-l-l -L breaks loose 
behind the scenes, honey, they, they not cool with you. They not loyal to you. They ain't loyal to nobody. This is somebody that said, it says competition, defeat, winning at all costs. This person undefeated two people in the back now. This person standing by themselves. So even if, say, say this was a group of people together that were bullying you, it's only one person left. These other people walking away like, man, I ain't even got no, I ain't even got no, uh, what would they say? I ain't even got no gun in this fight or how, how he put it. Ari's dad says something. How, I ain't got no dog in that fight. That's what it was. <laughs> I had to think. He be, he's so country. He be saying certain stuff. I, I ain't got no dog in that fight. That ain't got nothing to do with me. That's what he be saying. So it could be that. People are like, man, I ain't even got nothing to do with that. Um, what's the five of swords? Too busy winning. Yeah. Scarcity tactics. Moving on. Thank you. Next. See, some stalkers. Stalking, watching, obsessed. This person could literally be obsessed with you. Obsessed with you winning. Or they were obsessed with winning. That's why they was willing to do stuff for clout. They, you could have been. Like, this could be the type of person that's like, oh, I'm going to move on from you. And boop, 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 boop. Why are you pulling my cord, baby? This person could have been trying to like, oh, oh, this is giving me, oh my gosh, this is giving me like a bitter person. Like, well, I'm going to move on from you and I'm going to do better than you. When? Like, the, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? It's giving me like pettiness. Like, I'm going to win and I'm going to do so much better than you. And da, da, da. and like this person will go through a lot just to prove that they are doing better. Like this person will go in debt. One second. Okay. My bad, y'all. Had to get the kids straightened out. Um, But yeah. It looks like this person, okay, they're haunted because they did some in the past for clout. They did some for clout. Oh, goodness. <laughs> they did something. <laughs> you were not coughing. Did some for clout. They wanted to look like they were winning, right? They could even like breadcrumb you. Like barely gave you anything in order to win. Or in order to seem like they were winning. Yeah, go up there. Get your, get your cup. Get your sippy cup. Right here. There you go. All right, let's see. Let's see. What else do you have? Five of Swords. What's this about? Curious about you in reverse. Legal issues. This person may not have been worried about what was going on. You know what I'm saying? Legal issues, court judges, immigration. They're not really concerned about the legalities or. You know, whatever they, if they did something like against the law and stuff like that, they weren't concerned about that. They was only worried about winning is what I'm getting. But yeah, they weren't even concerned about like the legalities or like if, like if they did something illegal, it was like, oh, out of sight, out of mind type of energy. Okay. Out of sight, out of mind. What else do you have? Screenshots, getting evidence, proof and facts. And then jackpot. Yeah, winning money, got rich, inheritance, unexpected money. And then fishing for comments. Like this person, they wanted to... And the crazy thing is proof. Like whatever they did to get this win, you know, to like try to win at all costs or whatever this is, whatever they did to, to, to obtain this, there's evidence. <laughs> this is giving me like world's dumbest criminal or like world's, world's dumbest robbery or something something like that like creativity much or and confused steals your ideas copies your work duplicates feeds off of you like this is being caught red-handed like being exposed like like you steal something and then it's like you have proof of it oh my gosh like what is this divination abuser for some like it's for some of y'all this could be like stealing videos or like stealing somebody's content or something like what is This could literally, somebody's confused. Like, how you just going to steal my content? Or, like, how you going to steal that person's content? Like, what is you doing? Or, like, <laughs> what is this? This is, like, world's dumbest criminal. Like, yo, you know we can see you. Like, somebody may have, like, some sort of screenshot or, like, some sort of proof. This could be documentation. This could, this could be, I mean, this is... <laughs> Some of y'all, this could be somebody that's like a karmic, like obsessive. It says obsessive lover, dangerous, toxic, unhealthy, possessiveness, and karmic. Some of y'all, this is like a, 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 a unhealthy obsession that somebody has. Like, 
like let me go steal this person's content because I want to be just like them or something like that. Like that, I don't know. This is this is world's dumbest criminal. Like it's what it looks like. Like it's like knowing that it's not your time. Yo, it, this is not the right time to do this because you're gonna get exposed. Like I think they got cameras, and then you're like, this person's like, no, they don't have cameras, and then they go over there and they do something, and then it's like the whole alarm system goes off or something and it's like they get caught red hand and they like nah i didn't see that and they see them on camera you know what i'm saying like walking and i don't know child what's five of swords what's this five of swords we have orange black white butterfly could be significant low cut or bald head could be could be significant what else do you have this is crazy facial piercing dreads or braids what's this five of swords <laughs> somebody need to quit chasing clouds what it look like because honey they is it's not working sporty or luxury car or truck what do you have windshield wipers so it could be raining where you are or you need to change your win windshield wipers girls or boys night out what else do you have arm or leg sleeve tattoo biracial or multiracial Hating ass fire sign. Somebody could be a hating ass fire sign too. A sister or a brother could be significant. Or somebody calls somebody sister, bro. We have red, yellow, purple, blue, butterfly. Somebody could be a nurse, R E N C N A L P N, doctor, or surgeon. This person loves candy. They have a sweet tooth. <laughs> this person, you might catch them. This, this could be the person that eats candy all the time. 18 wheeler, a truck driver is there. All right, let's get uh, let's see if we can get zodiac signs and initials real quick. <laughs> what is going on, girl? What are you doing? Let's see. Last messages for this reading. Last messages. It's so loud. <laughs> she talking, you know? Yeah, tell it, girl. Tell it. Z at the bottom of the deck. Tell it, girl. The aunt or uncle just popped out, too. I don't know where they came from. Somebody could be a Libra. The month of September. April could be significant. We have a Leo. Somebody could be a Leo. P. G. <laughs> and E could be significant. So, I'm going to leave it there. This is what I have for you. Hope it brings you clarity and insight. Appreciate y'all so much for watching. Catch y'all in the next video. Bye, y'all.